different cereal. Pick up your brush today. We know that our brushes come with a plastic cap and、uh, glued together hair、uh, from the factory. We can't use our brushes this way, but we can follow three simple steps to open up our brushes. The first one is to squeeze the glued together hair to make sure、uh, the hairs loosened up. We squeeze it from the tip to the root of the brush very gently to loosen up all the hair on the brush. Then we can dip our brushes into clear water to remove the residual glue and make sure all the hairs opened up. We can apply a little bit、uh, pressure to the root of the brush as we dip it into the clear water. This step might take a little time, so as we wait. I'd like to tell you that、uh, the plastic cap that comes on top of the brush hair、uh, in the beginning,、uh, just throw it away. You can't really reuse it anymore after you open up your brush. So you want to be patient as you open up the brush and soak it in water. Now this looks pretty good. Step number three: we can remove the excessive water. You can see in a cir circular motion. Keep、uh, the tip in the middle still, and remove the excessive hair. That's very common on the new brush. So now your brush is up to speed. Here's a simple guide to help you hold a brush. First of all, let's take out our. Index finger and、uh, thumb to place them somewhere in the middle of your brush. Depending on the style we're going to do, our fingers might have different positions on the brush. Afterwards, we put our middle finger on top, and we want to touch the rest of the fingers from behind the brush. Now you're holding it, but let's check between your thumb and index finger. The shape should be circular, while the palm remains quite empty. We say you can almost feel an egg. Inside this empty space. Now, let's check if our bodies are、uh, aligned. Your fingers are moving. Yes, your wrist should remain low normally, and your elbow normally should be elevated from the table to give you maximum movement space. And that's pretty much it. You gotta remember to practice, practice, and practice. My name is Fiona. I'd like to see you in my class. For more information, check us out at inkdifferentstudio.com.